Entrapment damage is grooves in the belt from trapped material. Entrapment damage will eventually cause some excessive spillage and excessive dust. Entrapment damage is kind of tough to diagnose. If you look at the photograph on the left, you can see some grooves on both sides of this belt. And when users see these grooves on the belt, they are often concerned that their skirting is causing those grooves. If they're using a properly manufactured skirting that's designed to be used with conveyor belts, that skirting is not going to damage the belt. Now, there's going to be situations out there where there's facilities that are using whatever they can get their hands on as skirting. But properly manufactured and engineering skirting is not going to damage the belt. If you're using proper skirting and you see those grooves, it's most likely what we call entrapment damage. And what happens with entrapment damage is if there's a little bit of belt sag, like you see in this diagram, material will drop into that belt sag as it's conveyed forward, in this case to your right, that material then gets pinched between the skirt board and the belt by the upcoming roller. And then that material grooves the surface of the belt. So that's entrapment damage. It can be really problematic. It really can increase the amount of spillage that you have. It's gonna radically increase the amount of dust you're gonna have because it reduces that skirting's ability to seal properly. So the best way to prevent entrapment damage is to eliminate this belt sag that's so common by properly supporting the belt in that skirted area.